What's up guys, I am Josh Lee and I'm here with Chuck Casas from the Prop Store in San Diego Comic Con. We're at the booth and this is amazing. We have props and costumes from Marvel's Daredevil, Marvel's Iron Fist, and Marvel's Luke Cage. Now Chuck, what does it feel like to be a part of this? Uh, you know, it's a great, I'm a huge fan of these shows and have been a Marvel fan since the 80s when I grew up and it's amazing that we can bring these props costumes to the fans just like myself for them to preserve for years to come. Yeah, and it's not often that this happens no. and these are huge no. Marvel shows. Right behind us we have Marvel's Daredevil costumes, Marvel Iron Fist. Do you have a, a favorite one? You know, I have to say, I was a big fan of Marvel's Daredevil, and you have to look at Matt Murdock's red Daredevil costume, and you look at the fabrics and everything like that. It's just amazing to see in person, and you kind of want to wear it, too. At the beginning right here, down the line of these beautiful costumes, now Matt Murdock's bloodied fight costume. This is actually from season three, and how you know is if you look at the mask, there's a little hint of white in season three. They go into the churches, and they have nuns, and that's actually... Uh, an allusion to the nun's habit that's in there. And then he also, you know, sort of bulks up and has these Mai Tai gloves where he, well, I won't ruin it for folks, but he fights uh, a certain gentleman that's a little larger statue at the end, gets his hands a little bit, uh, a little bit bloodied there. Not only do you showcase these costumes, you know everything about them. Yeah, you know, when we, when we went through this and we researched it and Marvel was, was kind and said, hey, what did the fans want? Um, they actually put us in touch with the prop masters, uh, with the folks that were working on the production so that we could get the behind the scenes stories to share with the fans and put into our catalog so that people got, you know, more information about these great shows. Now we're gonna move on to Electra's battle costume. I love this. Yeah, I mean, this is this is great. I know it says don't touch up here for the for the general public, but I'll show you. This is a stunt version of the weapon, which is safe. So this is a, a stunt version so that they didn't hurt the actors. And you see the highlights of just the red and black throughout, all the way down to the shoes, up to the mask. Now, moving on, we can't forget about Marvel's Luke Cage. We have the iconic hoodie with the holes in it. That was specially done for the show. Uh, you'll notice the gold highlights inside when he pulls it down, and that was an allusion to his yellow costume that was in the comic books. Yeah. So they, they try to keep the you know, the comic book origins and show hints of that in the costume design that they did for uh, Marvel's Luke Cage. Now, in my opinion, my most favorite costume is the Daredevil costume. Now, the details on this are so vibrant. What does it feel like to have this in your booth? Uh, it, it's tempting, that's what it is. I mean, it, it is amazing, and you can kind of see if you get close-ups of the fabric, it's actually got a texture to it, it's got a glint to it, so that it would show a certain way on film. And they carried it through to, uh, you know, his infamous uh, Billy Club, so that, you know, that, that, that was part of the origin of Daredevil. So, how can fans partake into this awesome art auction? Well, it's open right now for bidding. If you go to propstore.com slash Marvel, you can see the entire catalog. There's almost 900 items across Marvel's Daredevil, Marvel's Luke Cage, and Marvel's Iron Fist that you can bid on. You know, at all price levels, we wanted to make sure this, this was accessible to all the fans. We've got a wide variety of things for, for folks in the auction from, say, $100 all the way up to Matt Murdock's red costume. So if you have $100, it's a really cool thing. We've got newspapers, we've got DVD cases, some great items from any character that you, you, you probably love. We've probably got something for you. Hopefully most of you will, will take a look at the catalog and find something you love and bid on it and take it home and curate it for, for years to come as part of your collection. Amazing, that's amazing. Chuck, thank you so much. This hey, was fantastic. Time, I geeked out totally at this booth. <laughs> Guys, this is a prop store at San Diego Comic Con, and this is Marvel Live.